For the first time in the history of Kabaddi at the Asian Games, India's men's and women's team did not win gold. Back in Delhi, a group of petitioners led by C. Honappa Gowda and S. Rajaratnam, both former internationals, filed a case against the Amateur Kabaddi Federation of India, alleging, among other things, corruption, failure to follow the guidelines of the National Sports Court and an opaque selection process. On August 3rd, the Delhi High Court removed Mridul Bhadoria Gehlot as president of the AKFI and declared her election invalid. Mridul is the wife of Janardhan Singh Gehlot, who was president of AKFI for 28 years before he was removed from the position in 2013 based on the sports code. Retired High Court Justice S.P. Garg is now the court-appointed administrator for the Kabaddi Federation. His job is to ensure that the Federation follows the rules, starting with ensuring free and fair elections to the body running the sport. At the KD Jadav Wrestling Stadium in New Delhi, on September 15th, another part of the Kabaddi soap opera was supposed to play out. Two unprecedented matches between the teams that represented India at the Asiad and the team selected by a court-appointed committee. What happened, however, was nothing like the dramatic showdown that those assembled had expected. The teams that went to the Asian Games were not at the venue. And the AKFI officials, though they declined to speak on camera, told us they were following the court's order by selecting a team based on an open trial that would then play against the senior national teams if required. The letter of the law, open as it is to interpretation and representation, may have been followed, but it was clear the so-called open trial was just a farce. Mass, mass participation should be ऑर्डर पड़ी है मास पार्टिसिपेंट होना चाहिए देश से कोने कोने से अभी तक किधर से आया देश कोने कोने से खाली दिल्ली का लड़का को बुला के ऐसा कर रहे हैं लोग हम लोगों ने कम से कम 100 जने से 12 12 जन को चुन के आ चुका है इसके ऊपर मैच खेलाने के लिए अभी आज के मैच अदरवाइज तो कोई इंटरप्रिटेशन उसका क्यों ले सकता है अनलेस कि उनका कोई और देश नहीं हो आज कोई हम किसी अपकमिंग इवेंट के लिए कोई टीम नहीं सेलेक्ट कर रहे हैं हां ये क्या हो ऐसा ये टीम खेल रही है क्या चल रहा है ये According to us, ये सिर्फ एक आयवाश है। आयवाश है ड्रामा चल रहा है। ये सिर्फ ड्रामा है। जो लोग जिनसे खेलना था, जिसके लिए खेलना था, जिनको टेस्ट करना था, जो एलिगेशन था, सुप्रीम कोर्ट में, हाई कोर्ट में, यदि वो नहीं आए, तो दूसरे ऐसे बदले मार लिए एक लाख लोग बोला कि हम आए सारे। Meanwhile, a rival body called the New Kabaddi Federation of India paraded teams on the other side of the wrestling hall. They claimed to have conducted an open trial and a 20-day camp and said they were ready to face the national squad. Retired Delhi High Court Judge Justice S.P. Garg, appointed interim administrator of the AKFI, was on hand to watch the farcical goings-on. He said he would present his observations to the court at the next hearing. For those of us at the venue on September 15, though, the observations were clear. On the one hand, the Pro Kabaddi League is beaming the rural sport into millions of homes, proving both popular and lucrative. On the other, politicians and administrators continue to devote their energies to playing petty politics in desperate attempts to retain some control over the sport and benefit from this newfound popularity. For Gorda, this is the ultimate insult. कबड्डी में ऐसा तो अन्याय हो रहा है उसको देख नहीं सकते तो इसीलिए हम लोग कैसे भी इसको रुकना करके हम दोनों डेरिंग करके कोर्ट में आए और बहुत सारा प्लेयर लोग हैं बहुत अन्याय इनको देख रहे हैं मगर वो लोग नहीं आ पा रहे क्योंकि डर रहे मेरे से मेरे बच्चों लोग मेरे क्लब लोग मेरा साथी लोग तो उनका जीवन खराब कर देगा बहुत लोगों को ये लोग कर चुका है देश में ये होना ये बंद होना चाहिए